Here's the situation. Let's say our project uses media displays or projection systems, and the client wants to get a better feel for what those systems would look like in actual use. The solution? Fuser's Assign Media feature. Let's start with 2D media assignment. First we'll locate the display we want to assign our media to. Next we'll navigate to the Camera Settings, Assign Media tab. Here you'll see two options. Click the left button labeled 2D Media. You'll notice that your tooltip now has a red square. Click on the upper left corner of the surface where you want to place your media. Next, move your mouse down and to the right to size your media display. Then click again to confirm. A dialog box will open allowing you to select your media file. Once selected, your media will begin playing immediately. You can even refit your media if it's not exactly where you want it to be. If you want to change your selected media, simply click on it. In the Element Properties window, click Media Path and select another media file. You even have the option to turn your media on and off. But what about placing media on a curved surface? That's where Projected Box comes in. As the name implies, Projected Box will project 2D media onto a 3D surface. To use Projected Box, locate a surface or temporary surface you'll be projecting from. Note that your media will be projected toward you. I want to project onto the planetarium dome, so I'm using a cross-section cut to create a temporary surface to project from. In the Assign Media tab, click the Projected Box button. Draw out your display area as you would in 2D Media Assignment and select your media. You should see a media display like the 2D Media display. Next, let's refit our projection source and turn off our cut plane. To visualize the projection box, click the Show Projected Shape checkbox. Now you can see where your media is being projected. Use the Distance slider to change your projection distance. The Alpha slider will adjust your brightness. Once you've done your final refits and turned off the projected shape, use the Media switch in the Element Properties window to turn off your projection source. You now have a functioning media system with which to wow your client.